Hi YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be showing you all my July 2022 setup and my mental health planner. If you all have not checked it out, definitely go do so. I just posted a video maybe a few days ago or last week on my wellness planner that I'm choosing to use. So I won't be housing mental health and wellness in here. I felt like it was kind of getting overcrowded and I found myself picking and choosing between what I wanted to put. Um, so I didn't want to feel limited. So for now, um, this is how it's gonna be. <clears throat> and this is in my traveler's notebook. So let's just get into it. So the first part of my travelers, the first part of the, the mental health and wellness has my a calendar that i just have so it's a calendar the weeklies and then so it's monthly weeklies and then i am also choosing to add in here my journal so right now i journal pretty often and right now i'm journaling in my exceed but i don't really like the notebook i like the paper of the exceed notebook that comes from walmart but I started it, um, I don't wanna waste the notebook, so I do need to take a slight break from it. And I just don't want to, my mental health has been slightly struggling, so I just don't want to have to worry about trying to fill up a notebook or having to write so much. So I feel like going into a traveler's notebook for my journal just for the rest of the summer july and august will be more helpful for me um overall and who knows i may like it anyway so let's get right into it so for july and i will do a flip through um for since i'm doing my setups for the whole month and versus to weekly like i did before i will be doing a flip through of the previous month so stay tuned for my flip through for june and this is july um i have really been into using my stamps which i realized i have not a lot but i have enough to use so i have been really like into using them lately and so that's what i used for july um i just added the 2022 down here and i used the label still that i have from um what's that um agenda 52 um so i just did the plain labels for that the plain white labels for that and i already filled in um the birthdays because it's three big birthdays this month um my sons my moms and their dads so i have that down um i just have this little loved um sticker with the scripture first john 4 and 9 and just simple things because when you see my flip through for june then you'll see why i left this pretty blank because i have been like really filling in throughout the month so that's how the monthly look for july and i am ending the end of this um traveler's notebook for in july i'll be ending it so two weeks is in two weeks for july is in here and then the last two weeks for july is into the new one so i wanted to do something simple and like i said when you see the flip through that i'm doing for june then you'll know why i gave myself quite a bit of space for here these are uh, um press not press ons what am i trying to say peel not peel uh gosh what am i trying to say the stickers that um i can't think of them but i'm pretty sure <laughs> you know what i am trying to do now i lost all vocabulary <laughs> just now but this is for um the fourth through the tenth um of course i'm still in the first few days will be into this week that we're in now um, but I just chose to put freedom. It is a sticker um, decal. Like, gosh, I wish I knew the word that I'm trying to say. And this just says red, red, white, and blue. And I did everything else in red. 
and for the next week this is just a nice little fun sticker i labeled a couple of days that i have off that i know i have off um and just the first lipstick just like a nice fun spread and i really like this washi tape because it has like so many different pairs of shoes it's just super cute and then the gold stickers for the gold weekly stickers that comes from agenda 52 and so after this this is the book that i'll be using i did order more of this layout for the weeklies but because i had this for a while now i just wanted to use it and see if i liked it better than this way um so this is the new one um it's the Midori Traveler's Notebook. I haven't decorated the outside because I'm not really sure what I want to put in it. And I didn't want to have to force myself to put something in it just for the sake of um, showing you all my monthly layout. So I did put some stickers that I know that I would be happy with for the remainder of the time in here. But first, coffee. And this is a sticker that came from Creative Faith, the company. And she has um different stickers for different seasons so she has girls that's for um summer winter spring and fall and so i use those i kind of wanted to leave it kind of simple um as you can see so that's pretty much what i did for here um i'm not really sure what i want to do in here i'm almost thinking about doing like a vision board type of setup but we'll see in the next month um, or the flip through, you'll see if I added anything different. So because this is a six, is it two, six, four, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, because this is a six month notebook, um, instead of using these for any, um, like normally how I did it before, I chose to use two per month for a tracker so two um two rolls i would use per month and for each month i'll choose two different things that i want to track so for um the month of june I mean, i'm sorry the month of july i'll be tracking sign language and studying so i've been trying to teach myself sign language i do have um at the beginning of the year, I set out goals that I want as far as to learn what I want to learn in sign language. So just as long as I'm practicing some at some point throughout the days, I want to notate that. And then studying because I am studying to sit for my state exam. And I want to track that. So my goal for the studying for the month of July is studying 20 days so is as long as i have 20 i know i hit my goal of course i would love to study every day but i know that's not really gonna happen so yeah so that's what i'm doing for that and then this is just going into the last two weeks so i used another one of the girls from creative faith and company and again i just made it really simple to give myself self some space for what I wanted to do. I do have birthdays because of the birthdays that's in um, the 18th and the 19th. That's why it's kind of in the middle. So that is for this week. And then the last week that's in July, um, again, the birthday celebrations. And yeah, it's just like a fun little mixture of a set. I've been really going through my stickers and trying to figure out what it is that I haven't used, what it is that I could use, and what is it that I can use that I've been saying, oh, I'm going to wait for this particular time to use it. I can say that I really like this Traveler's Notebook. I like the feel of the paper. Um, I like it. So, I like that I like it, but I also hope that I don't like it too much while I get and I get some more because I did order um, a set of these and three notebooks comes in the set that I ordered. So I still want to be able to use these, um, but I really just like the feel to this. So also, like I said, um, 
I will be housing my daily journaling in here. And because I wanted to be very specific with my daily journaling, that's another reason why I chose the Traveler's Notebook that is set for the days. Um, so again, I used my stamp set and I have been stamping like crazy since I found them, so to speak. Um, so I used really um, simple stickers for here and these came from Amazon and I just put July and August because that's what would be in here and it's already separated. So I just put in some washi, the traveler's notebook, um, stickers that came at the, at the front of the, the plastic package and my notebook. I put Toya's journal and this is another sticker that came from here, which I got from Amazon. And it's just really like a set of vintage stickers that I got from Amazon. And they're really nice and simple, so I like them. Going in, I put, uh, this was a printout from, this was just a printout from the internet. So I got that there and then what I'm using this section for is for gratitude. So for each day, I'll put down gratitude. Today is the 1st of July, so I already put um, the 1st of July down. And I really want to focus on gratitude. I know last November, I did a whole like Traveler's Notebook set for gratitude. And each day I did a picture. I took a picture and put a picture in of something that I was grateful for. So I feel like gratitude is so important, not only uh, for me being a Christian, but just in life in general. I feel like the more grateful you are for things, the more it helps in your life overall, mental health, physical health, just overall. So I want, I really want to be able to do gratitude daily um so i that's another reason why i like using this um midori traveler's note because it gives you that space for it without having to try and remember or create a space yourself and this is just a box sticker that came from one of my sets and so i did the stamping for each day the days the number of the days is labeled already but i just did the stamping of what month so then when i got to august i would know that's my son in the background you hear um so i did some stamping also and what i wanted to see as far as um i've really been wanting to use the flowers <laughs> as you can see and so i just used them for both of the days um starting in july i put new month i love the beginning of a new month i feel like i'm so hopeful i'm so excited motivated and all of that good stuff so um I'm just going to do a little bit of journaling in here and I will do a flip through at the end of the month for my journaling as well or I made it wait until the end of August to do a flip through of that. But yeah, and I had already put down some stickers for the birthdays that I knew um, and I just realized I put it on the wrong day because it's supposed to be the 19th. Oh gosh, I'm glad I looked at that. And I did do it for the 25th, too. At least that's right. But, oh, man, I hope I'll be able to move it over. But, yeah, I'm just really excited to see how I'm going to like journaling in a traveler's notebook. And I feel, I feel like tomorrow I have more things to write. Then I'll just write over these flowers. If not, I'll just use this space right here. So, yeah, that is my setup for July 2022 for my mental health planner. I had to stop myself from saying mental health and wellness because that's what it was before. And then again, I'll also be doing my daily journaling and leaving it in here as well. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. Hit that bell button so you'll know exactly when I post them. And definitely stay tuned for my flip through for June and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.